Hi, today I would like to show you the TerraXplorer mobile application. The TerraXplorer app is part of the Skyline Globe suite of 3D geospatial products. It lets you stream, view, analyze, measure uh, 3D geospatial content coming from uh, servers like Skyline Globe servers or public servers like WFS and WMS with many functionalities, geospatial functionalities for measurements, analysis, queries, and so on. Uh, in here, I have the TerraXplorer application. You can just start by launching it from your uh, TerraXplorer icon. And then we can start navigating and see the application, the data, and the functionalities that we will explore in this movie. The application comes with a default globe project that includes feature layers like countries, cities, US streets, and a few 3D cities in the, in the United States. From the main menu, I can click on the places page and fly to one of the locations, for example, uh, Fairfax County. I find a place that I'm interested in, and by pressing the terrain, I get the full address. Nice, now I can add it to my favorite places. Of course, I can always search for a specific location or address, so let's type in uh, Hoover Dam and see what we get. Okay, cool. Now we can mark it and share the results. Using the whiteboard, I can actually add labels, polylines, and polygons. And now I can take a screenshot and share it with others. The mobile apps works with other parts of the Skyline Globe suite, like the TerraXport Pro for desktop. So to publish this project, I use TerraXplorer on the desktop, build my project, and uh, then publish it to the mobile device. To demonstrate it, here I have the TerraXplorer project that contains feature layers, a 3D mesh layer created with Skylines Photo Mesh and City Builder, a presentation, and few locations. To upload the project to mobile, I click Publish Project as a mobile kit. Make sure the mobile is connected, and that's it. The project is copied to the device, and I can use it there. I open the Places page again, this time from the shortcut menu, which is by the way customizable to any other feature. And uh, from here I can also play uh, the presentation. One of the main advantages of the TerraXplorer mobile app is that it also includes a large set of measurements and analysis tools. Let's quickly review some of the tools. Okay, so now I want to show you the measurement and analysis tools. I click here on the menu and then I have the analyze. The first tool I will show you is the distance tool. I click here a few points on the runway. I get the distance measurement on the different segments, the total distance as well as the total ground distance, which actually follows the curvature of the terrain. So this was the distance tool. Again, on the menu, click Analyze. And the next tool is the view shed, 3D view shed tool. I click the viewer position over here, then another point for the target. And I get a 3D view shed analysis that shows me in green the visible areas and in red the hidden areas. I can move about and see the result of this analysis from different directions. Um, let's go here to this view. And the next thing I will show you is the Terrain Profile tool. Let's go over here to an area with some uh, mountains. Okay and click here, analyze, click terrain profile, define two points on the two sides of the hill, and click terrain profile. This will now analyze, actually get the data from the server. I get a very cool terrain profile tool analysis 
I can zoom in and out, I can get the max slope uh, and minimum and maximum altitude, various uh, information in a very nice and cool uh, display. So this was the terrain profile tool. I will leave it to you to continue exploring these powerful tools. The app also comes with a nice contour map which can help us understand the elevation differences on the terrain. And the slope map that shows the degree of steepness and its direction. From the layers page, I can toggle layers on and off. More on the layers page, I can also edit a feature layer and save it back to the server. This uses the OGC transactional protocol, the WFST, and allows the mobile user to push updates to any server, including the Terragate SFS. Thanks for watching, I hope you have enjoyed the movie and the functionalities in the Terexpo mobile app. It's available in the app stores and in skylanglobe.com. Thank you very much, see you again.